Alright guys, so today we're going to be looking at a remake of the texture pack that I made a while back, about 11 months or so. It was a Christmas pack, and uh, it did pretty well, so I thought I would go ahead and make another version of it. And uh, well, here it is. So I, I basically did the same thing as I did last time. I took a bunch of texture packs and I mashed them all together. And uh, here's the finished product of it. So let's uh, go ahead and go over here. Uh, we have Christmas chests right here. You can tell the part of... Christmas chest and, uh, or not Christmas chest, uh, trap chest and normal chest by seeing the, uh, things right here, the, uh, stars, sorry, <laughs> and then we have the green, uh, tip of the stars, so that's how you can tell their trap chest against, uh, normal chest, and, uh, we have the pickaxe, the axe, the fishing rod, um, the flint and steel, that's what fire looks like, we have the bow, uh, it has a charging handle on it, it's pretty nice. We have the arrow right here, looks pretty good. Uh, we have the gold sword, the iron sword, the wood sword, stone sword, and then the diamond sword. Uh, I did, oops, <laughs> didn't mean to do that. I did change the sword, it's from an Ariana pack or something like that, and it was normally pink, and I changed it to green, and I also changed the heart, and then I changed that right there. Uh, as you can see, the little square, I changed that to red. It used to be uh, pinkish, or I think, something like that. Uh, here's the diamond armor. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put it all on and here's what it looks like All red and stuff like that. It's pretty nice uh, Let's go ahead and clear inventory. Um, we have a potion of poison, healing, fire resistance, fire resistance, sorry uh, Golden apple, mushroom stew, uh, baked potato that's like hot chocolate and cookies, uh, ender pearl, and pumpkin pie so that's what the ender pearl looks like. It looks kind of weird. Uh, I just wanted to make a green. I'm not sure if I quite like this ender pearl, but it's uh, it's fine. Um, there's a big potato, mushroom stew. The mushroom stew is pretty normal. Uh, I think it's a faithful one. This is from uh, some random Christmas pack, and it's pretty nice. The golden apple. And uh, here are the potions. So we have speed. Let me go ahead and get milk. Uh, here are the buckets as well. They, uh, they look pretty nice, they're kind of darker. Alright, there was the speed, um, the particles for it. Here is the fire resistance, orange particles. And last we have the potions, and there's some hearts. And then the same thing, triangles. Triangles, sorry. Alright, and then moving on to the ores, we have right here. Gold, iron, coal, lapis, diamond, redstone, emerald, and quartz. And on the back, then we have the... Uh, uh, well, those are missing. Um, hang on. All right, there we go. Um, we have everything now. So there's the lapis again, the emerald, redstone, diamond, lapis. Er, I meant quartz over there. Oops. Uh, coal, iron, and gold. And uh, these ores are really nice. Um, anyway, we've gone to the wood. We have birch, jungle, oak, and spruce. And then... Um, we have dark wood? Dark wood? Uh, I guess I've never put dark wood here. That's dark wood. Obviously, it's the darkest wood, <laughs> I guess. There you go. And uh, there's a comparison. I don't know why these are here. Could have just made them under there. But anyway, uh, we're going to go ahead and look at the particles on the crits and everything like that. So let's go ahead and spawn a villager in. Here's the normal particles. And here are the critical particles critical particles <laughs> okay uh, it's like Santa hats and everything it looks pretty nice they look kind of yellowish but it's uh still all good there we go and uh, here's the anvils uh, here's how the stone bricks look the redstone lamps all the nether the nether rack the nether brick the soul sand and the glowstone um, and then if we want to go down here or that's what the glass looks like if we want to go down here we have water and then we have lava. You guys can definitely change this lava if you want to. It's not the nicest lava. You guys can change it. Um, here's the, what the fire looks like. We have low fire and everything. Uh, also, uh, the HUD, or not the HUD. Uh, yeah, actually the HUD. Um, and everything like that. The hot bar is what I meant to say. Uh, yeah, it's red and then has this green uh, um, scroller over it. And then uh, go ahead and show you guys the XP real quick. Uh, nope, okay. Uh, no? Okay. Bottle. Guess you can't search for that in this update. But anyway, uh, there's the XP. It's like a candy cane, pretty much. It's, uh, red and white. And, uh, here's the inventory. It has my skin face right there. Um, and it's clear GUI. Everything else is a clear GUI as well. And, uh, 
but yeah so that's pretty much it for this part and i'm gonna go ahead and go into a fight and show you guys uh that uh so yeah that's uh pretty much it for this though if you guys enjoyed uh the download links are in the description and something that i do want to say real quick is that there is more to this than just this pack there's also a, uh, also a faithful pack right here we'll go ahead and load this one in and it's basically just the faithful blocks and then the rest of the the same things that I showed you guys a second ago. So you guys, if you do want to run uh, at, I think, um, more FPS because that one is kind of a nicer pack, uh, you guys can go ahead and use the faithful one and you'll have all this stuff. Um, still a good pack and all, and it just has a faithful block. Some people enjoy the, like, the default look of Minecraft instead of the like over um, customized blocks and everything like that. You guys can go ahead and use faithful if you want to, but the download link is in the description and uh, peace out.